you know, I'm leaving on Monday, August 15th to basic training in South Carolina. I'm flying out of Corpus and I just want to say thank you for everything that you've done or all of y'all have done for me for the past 18 years from pushing me to get here from to mentoring me to to yelling at me for no reason mom <laughs> uh blaming me for stuff rudy and just constantly being here for me loving me caring for me giving me a, a roof over my head um i'm gonna be gone for like four to five months i would say and these four to five months are going to be long and hard not just mentally but physically too i'm going to be without y'all for four to five months on my own for the first time in 18 years all right rudy <laughs> Uh, I just want to thank you for, for like, I don't know, just being stupid, blaming me for stuff that I didn't even do, that you did. Uh, like, just playing games with me, making YouTube videos with me, making me memories that we'll be able to watch like 20, 30 years down the road together when we, like, when we possibly have our own families. Uh, mom. I want to thank you for everything, yelling at me for no re <laughs> no well, not for no reason, but just yelling at me, um, pushing me to do better, uh, always being there for me when I need to talk, making me, trying to make me cut my hair. Uh, yeah, it's like. I don't even know where I was before I got rudely interrupted. Um, oh yeah. Mom. You try making me cut, you try making me cut the hair off. You know how long it took me to grow this? And it's all gonna be gone in like two seconds when I, whenever I leave. And dad, I just wanna thank you for putting up with me, all the stupid stuff I do giving me like, I don't know, everything that I could possibly ask for. I'm going to like really miss you guys. It's gonna be hard without y'all, but I know I'll get through it and we'll get through it together. Everybody, it's gonna be hard for everybody, but we'll all get through it together, no matter how hard it is. Just know that I'm that I'm gonna come back to y'all. I'm gonna look like a whole different person, but I'll come back. <laughs> but I'm coming back to y'all. Um, y'all mean the absolute world to me. I wouldn't be here right now without y'all. Without y'all pushing me, helping me, guiding me, like through the years of my life. Like without y'all. I don't know where, well, I don't know, like, where I would be. Y'all are the best family members, parents that I could ask for. I wouldn't want anybody else pushing me and helping me with this journey. This next, just next step in my life to make me a even better person than what I already am now. So. Oh, I forgot Rhea. Rhea. I don't know if you're gonna see this, but you probably will. When they, when everybody watches it together, you better be there, Rhea, or I'm fighting you. But Rhea, I don't know. Thank you for just being my daughter. <laughs> like just being there for me whenever I needed it. Um, comforting me, lick, lick, always licking me for no reason. Like, I could just be sitting there and she'll lick my leg or my face. She jumps on me for no reason. She barks at me for no reason. She also hates the word what. 
like if you tell her what in like a like in a like in a rude way she'll bark at you i know firsthand because she barked at me sadly she barks at me all the time even when i don't take her out and when that whenever uh dad wakes up in the morning i have to take him or what to take Rhea out she's always scratching and barking at my door so dad can open the door and let her out and then he takes her out leaves my door open leaves my door cracked now i wake up in the morning see my doors cracked and Rhea's just laying on the floor waiting for me to wake up to take her out again so i don't know how far down like it's going to get to everybody like i don't know if it's just staying here or going far throughout but who else grandma Thelma thank you for letting me go to your house all the time after school when I was in like seventh and eighth grade I would always go over there and eat all your pickles yes I still love pickles <laughs> those pickles were so good and then just playing outside, waiting for my mom to get out of work, and then just hanging out with you, making memories that'll that'll last forever. No matter how far, how far away I go, all these memories will always stay with me forever. Grandma Cookie, I just want to thank you for everything like just allowing us to go up there and stay at your house play with the dogs make a mess and clean it of course but just like allowing us to have a place to stay at up there well whenever we needed to actually like there's not a time that i won't call call you and you won't answer unless unless you're asleep or working but other than that I know any other time you'll answer. Well, that goes for everybody. Like, like everybody will answer unless they're asleep, working, or busy. So, everybody, I just want to thank y'all with my entire heart. I want to say thank you for doing everything for me. Thank you for pushing me. Thank you for like just being there for me every single step of the way on this journey. It's going to be a different journey for me and for my mom and dad and brother because we haven't done it. Well, they haven't done this before, but it's going to be a long and good amazing journey for all of us and I know that all of y'all will always be here for me whenever I need to talk or whenever I need help doing something I know I can just call y'all or text y'all and y'all you will be here for me and just know that I love y'all and I'm gonna come back to y'all so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back, looking different, feeling different, thinking different. Just I'm not gonna change. So just know that these last few days here, these what six days that I have left, I'm going. To, I'm. I'm I'm going to try to make the most of them, the most I can, enjoy my last six days as a, as a normal civilian, <laughs> what they would call it, but thank y'all for everything. I can't wait to get back to see y'all. I know it's going to be one good journey. It's a uh, 
it's a different part of my life that I never thought that I would be doing. And to that, I just want to say thank you to everybody, and I love you, and I'll, I'm going to come back to y'all. I hope whenever you're watching this, you have a you have a good day, a good night, and I hope you can just re-watch this and like, think of me or something, or just look at pictures of me or something, but... I hope you have a good day, good night, and I love y'all.